Okay, guys, hey, we found another 69, except this thing is green with white stripes, and it's so beautiful, man. I just had to make a video on it. 396 SS. This thing is real nice. And guess what? That's right. Stick shift. How we love the manuals. Or oh, how we love the manuals. Can't beat a manual, man. Automatics are nice if you're a chump or a punk. I love stick shift. I don't know about many of you guys, but I love stick shift. Love banging gears. Look at the back seats. Immaculate. Headliner is great in here. This thing got a great scent to it coming out of here. But not as great as burning some rubber. <laughs> Roof is in great condition. Glass. White head heritage stripes on the back. Here's the other one. There's a blue one sitting right behind it. We'll get on that in a minute. Nice big pipes coming off the back of here, man. This Chevelle is nice. And since we're here, we're going to go ahead and do the driver's side of this blue one. Another 69. Both sitting here at MGM Classic Cars. This one here is nice condition. Nice 69. As you can see the trunk, excellent condition. Nice glass on here. This is an automatic seat, black headliner, tuxedo look on the inside of here. Gauges, everything, dashboard, all looks great. We're gonna do the passenger sides. Be right back. This thing is really good looking car, man. I love the green scheme on this. This is nice, because you don't see too many green ones. As we look in through the passenger side, this side of the bench, you can see how big that gear shifter is, man. I love that. It is so nice. Man, I used to see them things and be like, wow, that's a big stick down there. Well, yeah, because you want to bang these gears on a 396, man. You want to move these tires back here. And by the way, look at those rims. Those Magnum rims with the SS hub on there. That's nice. Real nice. As we look at the blue one, you know, this is a nice car. There's nothing to laugh at. You got those torque rims on here. I don't know if those American racing. I couldn't look down any further, but the glass on here is really great. As we look at the body, and the trim, this is a nice car here. This thing is really nice. And I'll tell you, both of these cars are sitting here at MGM Classic Cars. And uh, we got another car to look at. And so we'll be right back. And here we go, guys. This is a beautiful Buick GS. This thing's got a 350 in it. And man, this thing is nice. It's not even a stage one, but as you guys can see, it's a beautiful Bu Buick, and this thing is clean for the year model. It's very clean with the green paint and those torque, those Magnum rims. This thing is nice, really nice. I mean, Buick has some nice cars, man. And you got just like the Pontiac, you got your hood tech, you know. These things are nice, but and it's a convertible. And it's a convertible. This thing, you know, these were popular models. <sighs> they were everywhere at one point in time. At one point in time, no matter where you went, they were everywhere. You know. But it's a convertible. And if you're into convertibles, this is what you're looking for. This is what you want. It's sitting right here. This thing's automatic. Oh my God, 
about 120 on the speedometer. Gauges, everything. This is nice. Roll down windows. Go back to the old school way of doing things. We're gonna look at the passenger side. As we look at the other side of this engine, this thing is really in great condition, man. It's clean, air conditioning, everything for convertible. <laughs> you know, it's pretty clean in here. For And it's a 350. I prefer a 455, but beggars can't be choosy when it comes down to these beautiful cars, man. This thing is really, really nice. Really, really nice. I mean, if you're watching this video, you don't see anything wrong with the body. So I know this car is in really good shape, excellent condition, you know. And if you want pricing and specs, drop a comment down below. Let me know. I would definitely find out for you, you know. But this car is sitting here along with the two Chevelles at MGM Classic Cars. And you should see the gauges and the dashboard on the passenger side is very clean, no cracks, no tears. Not even the passenger side seat, front or back. This thing's in ec excellent condition, man. Carpet, it's got the original floor mats, everything for the Buick. Yeah, this is a real nice car, man. And it's just sitting here looking for a home. Okay, guys, Buick, two Chevelles, later.